Located on the western side of Colorado in Rio Blanco and Garfield counties, directly on the Utah border, lies Unit 21. Hunters that want to get away from the crowds recognize this unit as an escape to hunt without the added pressure and distractions by large groups of other hunters. Unit 21 has been a top trophy mule deer destination for years. Mild winters, good habitat, and high protein browse all contribute to the quality of big game. Unit 21 is mostly accredited for its trophy mule deer, averaging between 150 and 170 inches with a trophy potential measuring well in excess of 180 inches. The versatility of the landscape makes this unit a challenging and fun hunt. During the archery and muzzleloader seasons, the climate is particularly warm, which causes water sources to become undoubtedly more valuable to the deer during this time. The opportunistic hunter can set up a blind adjacent to one of these water sources, increasing the chance of spotting good mule deer. As the season progresses and the weather cools down, the deer will move out of the barren snow-covered areas and onto greener pastures. The current buck to doe ratio is 34 to 100. The pressure of elk hunting is higher in this unit due to the over-the-counter availability for archery, second and third rifle seasons. Trophy elk are harder to find in this unit, but persistence and tactfulness will pay off for the hunter that puts the work in. The multitude of trails and roads in this unit make it easily accessible for hunters. However, it can also be a cause for concern since the traffic can be disruptive. If you can get off the beaten path, there are remote areas where you may be more successful in finding bigger bulls. The average quality of elk in Unit 21 varies anywhere between 260 to 300, with the potential of a 330 plus bull. The current bull to cow ratio is 24 to 100. The terrain has significant variances in Unit 21 depending on which area you are hunting. The Northern Territory along the White River has a drier climate with rolling hills and shrub, scrub, land cover. Water is more scarce, which is a disadvantage for the wildlife, but an advantage for hunters looking to find an area where the animals will congregate. The western side along the Utah border has a higher elevation and is predominantly colder due to its altitude. The south end of the unit is a greener, more lush environment with evergreen forested areas. The eastern side of the unit has a mix of dry land densely populated with short shrub cover. The more difficult terrain is going to be in the western and southern portions of the unit. The roads mapped throughout Unit 21 form a network of access for hunters. As far as highways go, Colorado State Highway 139 runs north and south throughout the unit. There are several unfinished roads that 4 before would be preferred to trudge through. Be mindful of which areas are banned for motor vehicle use and ATVs in Unit 21.